Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name's Danielle. Subscribe down below. I post videos all the time. Today, if that's okay, I just want to talk about some things that I've been loving. Is that cool? I love videos where people just talk about their favorite products because it's just so fun. So I have a ton of things I want to talk to you guys about. I have podcasts I've been loving, music, hair products, skin products, perfume, makeup, accessories, fashion, music. I think I already said that. Oh my. I'm so excited. I just love filming videos like this, especially where I can just sit down and chat with you guys. I'm in a good mood. It's a good summer day. There's not really much to say other than I will have everything linked down below that I talked to you guys about in this video. Make sure to follow me on Instagram. I've been posting a lot on there and I post like little Insta stories of stuff I like too. Yeah, without further ado, let's get started with the favorites video. All right, first up, I wanna talk about a pair of shoes. These are my shoes of the summer. I can't stop wearing them. I've only had them for like two weeks and I'm obsessed. I love them so much. I got them at Zara. So I'll hopefully be able to find a link and I will have them down below or some similar ones. I've seen these at a lot of different stores and they never had my size or whatever it may be. These are super comfortable. I just love this whole espadrille style. Um, I got them in a size 38 because they're European sizes. I will say they were like $60, but they're really, really good quality, super comfortable. They're perfect for going to dinner or if you have like a daytime brunch situation. I just love these. These are epitome of summer shoes and I'm obsessed with them and you guys need these shoes because they're so cute and I'm so happy I bought them because I almost didn't because I already have so many shoes but these I've been wearing a lot so it's worth it. Next up I'm almost done with this which really means I love it. This is the L'Occitane Supple Skin Oil with Almond Oil. I actually got this two summers ago and I'm finally almost out. It's amazing. It's a spray, so that's really convenient. And basically, I put this on. I've been doing it especially because I'm just like in beachy mode and like you're showing your legs a lot. Basically, it's kind of like, you know when you put on tanning oil when you're at the beach and your skin looks so good and glowy and just shiny? Like, I like that look. Like, I want my legs to look nice and smooth. This is that, plus it smells good and there's obviously like no SPF or anything in it. I love this after I shower to put it all over my body. It's basically like putting on body mist and body lotion at the same time, but it's an oil. It smells so good. Like I put this on and everyone's like, you smell so good. And it's like coming from your skin. So, and it lasts a really long time and it makes your legs look so nice. And I put a little bit on my arms as well. It's super flattering. I'm obsessed with it. I seriously suggest it. It's a great product for the summer as well. I'm definitely about to repurchase, so. My one makeup product is this, the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish Skin Perfecting Micro Powder. I have it in shade number two, medium. It's basically just a setting powder. I really, really like it though. Um, basically, I'll just use it on like my forehead, a little bit on my nose and my chin. Um, basically, the T-zone area. Because I do like a glowy look, like right here, but I don't like a glowy look on my forehead. That's just for, not for me. So I just take a flat top kabuki when I'm done with like doing my CC cream or foundation and just set it um, in the areas that I get the most oily and I love this it's super nice quality I will tell you that much and I really like it so and I bought this a little bit ago and I told you guys I tell you if I like it and I like it. another product I have here is this perfume that I got back into you know when you come home and you have like your bedroom at home if, if you're in college you know what I'm talking about you like come home and you have all this stuff that you left and you didn't bring to college with you and you're like wow so I've been I left this at home this is the Lalia wish perfume I forgot how good this stuff smells I think they sell it at anthropology I'll have a link down below I still have so much left of it Again, not great at describing scents, and there's not a description on here, but it smells so good, and you just need to go smell it, or just trust me on it and just buy it because it smells that good. <laughs> but yeah, this with that almond oil smells amazing. You literally just smell so good. Everyone just like wants to smell you. I know that sounds really weird, and it lingers. Like I can, I, you know when you spray perfume and then you don't smell it after an hour, and it's like, should I spray more? And then you spray more, and everyone's like, whoa, there, sister, because you can't smell it, but you do still smell like the perfume. Well, this one, an hour later, I'll like be like, oh, shoot, you smell good, Danielle. <laughs> I'll even spray a little bit in my hair, so it kind of like, gives off scent when I move my hair. I don't know, I'm weird, but it works. As for jewelry, I've been wearing these earrings like it's my job. If you guys have been watching my recent videos and vlogs, I've been wearing these a lot. These are just little mini gold thick hoop earrings. They're from the brand or the designer Love AJ off of Revolve. They're awesome and I just, I like the clasp. They stay on my ears really well. They don't like jingle around. They just feel really secure. Like I accidentally fell asleep in them the other day and like I was okay. You know, I don't know, actually, actually that I accidentally took a shower in them the other day. I was okay. They're perfect, like I've been wearing them to the pool if I wanna be more bougie and everything like that and they look great, they're still great quality and they're not that bad of a price. I wanna say they're like $70 or something, but that's like really good and they've lasted me a while. Another product I've got here is this. This has been my holy grail. If you guys live in Florida, have been to Florida in the summer, you know the gist, humid as heck. 
humidity is a real thing and it sucks sometimes. So I got this, this is the Living Proof No Frizz Humidity Shield. And basically after I'm done styling my hair, um, I'll straighten it or curl it or whatever it may be and just spray this in layers on my hair and I'll just like brush it through or comb it through with my fingers and it really has worked. I used it today, and as you can see, my hair is not frizzy at all, whereas it should be. It's like 93 degrees outside. Humidity is at a high. If you're outside for like five minutes, you're sweating when you get back in the car, like it's bad. So with that, the humidity makes my hair like just bleh after I'm done styling it, which is so annoying when you take so much time to style it. So this is awesome, and I can't believe it's actually worked. Like I was like, no way this is gonna work. And I used it, and I love it, and I'm just so happy about it. So I wanted to tell you guys about this because this is awesome, and it sucks when you do your hair and then it's ruined. The last tangible thing I have to show you guys, I always like to put a little splurge item in there somewhere. This is the Gucci Dionysus Supreme Midi Crossbody Bag. I love it so much. It has gone with absolutely everything. You guys know I'm more of a gold person, but this is kind of like a darker, more matte silver or metal, I guess you could call it. And it just, I love the look of it. It has been great. It fits absolutely everything I need. I don't really carry a lot in my purse. I just carry my vlog camera, my little wallet, keys, and like a lip product and sunglasses and my phone. So it's awesome. I love it because you can fold it like this and it's so cute or kind of like this. Or the reason I got it is as a crossbody. I'm going to bring this to Greece with me. It'll be my nice everyday bag. I just love it. I like how it's more of a neutral. I mean, if you if you know Gucci, you obviously know it's Gucci, but like sometimes people don't know it's Gucci and I kind of like that. It's more low key, if anything. But yeah, this is my splurge item. I'm very thankful that I can purchase items like this for myself. Um, and it was a really big girl moment walking into Gucci alone and just being like, let's do this. As so. for music, I have some stuff written down. I just don't want to forget. As for music, I am into SoundCloud lately. Obviously, I'm still on Spotify. I listen to all my playlists. I just haven't found any new music lately. So I've been going to SoundCloud just to listen to fun summer remixes, like the Big Booty remix that just came out. It's like what the remixes are called. They have a ton of Big Booty remixes. So good. We listened to it on the boat the other day. I was like, oh my gosh, it's just good song after another. I have to add that to my playlist. So basically what I'm saying is, I have so many songs I'm loving right now. They're just fun remixes, like when you're driving, if you're at the beach and you just wanna like have a good time. I've been working on a summer 19 playlist on my SoundCloud. My SoundCloud's always linked down below. You guys should check it out. And I have a ton of really cool remixes under that playlist. In specific, my all time favorite remix I've been listening to literally every day to get myself hyped up. I think I featured it in like one or two vlogs. The Say My Name Hermitude Remix. Oh my gosh, it is so good. It's like, dun, 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 dun. Oh, I don't even know how to explain it. You just have to listen to it and it's so hype and you're just like, yes, let's go. I'm also a big EDM person, so, but it's still like fun and happy and like my other friends, like, I don't know. That's the vibe lately. As for podcasts, I always have to hype up Gals on the Go podcast. That's myself and Brooke Michio's podcast that we post new episodes every Wednesday in the morning. So you guys can listen to it on your morning commutes or for school or when you're tanning by the pool, it's awesome. And we do different topics each week. And in each week we talk about our current favorite products, our highlights and lowlights of the week. And it's just like an overall good time. So make sure to listen to that one. But my good friend Tori Sterling just came out with her own podcast. It's called Manifest. It's also on iTunes and Spotify. It is so good. I love that girl so much. She's a YouTuber, if you guys didn't know, and she also just opened her very own spin studio. Her first episode was kind of about like body confidence, body positivity, like finding her health journey. And it was so, so, so relatable. That girl is just absolutely amazing. And I just love her voice. It's She's so soothing. And she just makes me feel better about life. And then one episode she talked about when she tried to move to LA to be a YouTuber and how that didn't work out. She talked about going to college and dropping out and then starting her own spin studio. It's just been amazing. And I just love her podcast and I love her so much. And I just wanted to give her podcast a shout out because it's awesome. So yeah, that's actually everything that I wanted to talk to you guys, show you. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I love favorites videos. I Ugh, they're just so much fun and I just love seeing what other people like. I'm creepy. So yeah, thanks so much for watching. I will have everything linked down below per usual, and I'll see you guys very soon for my next video. Make sure to subscribe. Bye guys.